get used to bringing back your empties. Iceland's supermarket already gives customers money off vouchers to encourage recycling and now the Environment Secretary has said he strongly supports a national scheme with all drinks bottles being sold with a small deposit returned to customers through reverse vending machines. It's a measure Sky Ocean Rescue has campaigned for. We need to work with business to make deposit return schemes as effective as possible. But I believe an all-in model will give consumers the greatest possible incentive to recycle. Almost 36 million plastic bottles are used in the UK every day, but less than 20 million of these are recycled. The rest, 16 million, end up in landfill, litter or a burn for energy. But deposit schemes have dramatically boosted recycling rates in other countries and polls show they're supported by the public. It keeps the bottles off the floor, it keeps the streets nice and clean and it also helps the environment. And on top of that you get money off your shopping for every donation you get, so it's a win-win really. It's a good idea to you know, uh, do recycling with the plastic bags in the shops and also it's 10 pence per bottle, you know. But some retailers wanted the Deposit Return Scheme, or DRS, to apply to only smaller bottles with larger sizes collected through household recycling. To put a DRS on top of that is going to take some time to make sure that we get it right. And that's going to take time to, put, to build the machines, to purchase the machines, to set up the logistics, to take back all of these materials, and also put in place the recycling infrastructure in this country so that we're not exporting the materials abroad for other countries to deal with. This still needs to be signed off by the next Prime Minister, but Michael Gove has effectively tied the hands of whoever that is by so firmly and publicly endorsing a comprehensive scheme. The only way out now is for the Prime Minister to appoint a new Environment Secretary. With Extinction Rebellion on the streets again, the government is under pressure to act on environmental issues, from plastic to climate change. Mr Go vowed to make legal commitments in a world-leading environment bill later this year. The campaigners will hold him to it. Thomas Moore, Sky News.